So I saw that we weren't quite done yet because we also had to calculate the correlation based on the covariance just that we just calculated uh, in this upper part. So let's do that. So the only thing we had to do for calculating the correlation is dividing the covariance that we just calculated by this thing. And what was this thing? Yeah, we did this in a previous video because this was the standard deviation for one item multiplied by the standard deviation of the other item. Um, so if we go back to our um, uh, Excel file, this means that we have to divide the covariance by the standard deviation of one item multiplied by the standard deviation of the other item. So we're going to do that. So this is the correlation. And the correlation is the covariance uh, divided by oh, divided by the standard deviation of one item, that's this one, multiplied by the standard deviation of the other item. I think this is it. Yeah, that's the correlation.